recently, we've been seeing quite a few more smooth hounds down here than we often did in the past. So this Sunday, we had the chance to go out on African Queen, and we thought, you know, let's have a go with some light tackle and see how we do. Well, as we were going past the scurries, we were also treated to the sight of some dolphins jumping, which was a welcome change. <laughs> We all set up in our different ways. For myself, I still like the quick release boom which I make myself. I find it's just so simple to change. One minute you could be pollock fishing, the next you can be drifting over a wreck, the next one you can be going over for bass, or you can be putting down heavier tackle for smooth hound. Either way, it's a very, very simple tackle and a very easy one to use. It was a bit quiet at first, and then a few small spider catch outs appeared. There were a couple of small bull husks, there were a few small conger, and then a couple of smooth hounds began to appear. I had a spotted ray, my nemesis, that had put me in hospital last time, so I had to be a bit careful with that one. After that, I had three smooth hounds, and since one of them was a record for Baywater anglers, I was feeling quite good about that. Then I noticed Brian's rod take a much deeper bend. I started getting ready to weigh Brian's fish for him and hopefully get some nice photos of it as well. So I had to go up to the cabin, I had to get a weighing mesh, and then as I looked round, I noticed that the butt of my rod had suddenly lifted off the deck. At that moment in time, I'm sorry Brian, but the fish came first. I knew it was going to be a great fight. I was using an Abu Garcia Veritas rod, which was basically a 7 gram to 21 gram lure rod. And that was going to give a sensational fight. At least, that's what I expected. Let's see what happened.
And that was it. My Smooth Hound wasn't as big as Brian's. Brian's was £10.3, a new club record. Mine was £7.12. Still a nice fish. Not my biggest of the day. My biggest of the day had been £9.1, which was very briefly a Baywater record. But all in all, with everything that we'd caught on board the boat, it was a lovely day. I shall get out there again soon, and I hope that my friends will join me once again. In the meantime, thank you for watching, and I wish you all the best with your fishing. Perhaps one day you'll get a chance to have a go to target some hard-fighting Devon smoothhounds yourself. It would be nice to see you succeed. So once again, thank you for watching. It's been very much appreciated. Goodbye.